This is the MIDI hub. It's a combined six-way MIDI splitter plus a um, clock distributor. So it has a built-in MIDI beat clock generator that is sent out through each of the output ports. And the, the idea of it is you can use this to um, sync up multiple um, MIDI devices. This is really intended to be used in a kind of a jam session situation where maybe you've got a bunch of people with MIDI devices playing along to each other to a common beat clock. So this lets um, a central point control the beat. But it has lots of other applications as well. Okay, so first I'll plug it in. It takes power from a USB input. It has a mini USB adapter here. This is only used for power. There's no actual USB connectivity to it. Okay, so once it's plugged in, you can see it's pulsing away at its uh, internal clock rate. I can change the clock rate by clicking on this button to increase the, the tempo and this button reduces the tempo. The range is about 30 BPM to 250 BPM. If I press both buttons together it takes me to the default of 120 BPM so that will turn me to 120. If I click on this button here this is the clock start so this is now sending um, the MIDI beat clock through the outputs. If I click on this again stops it. So let's actually plug something into one of the outputs. I've got a um, drum machine here. Bring it in. So if I click on the start, you can hear that playing. So let's speed that up. Now let's slow it down, start it, sorry stop it and restart it. A restart also does the um, uh, clock reset, so it will start it back at the beginning of the bar, as you can hear there. Okay, now let's sync it up with something else. So I'm going to bring in a, sequ a little sequence bass line coming from Reason. So I'm just going to plug that into another one of the output ports. Reason set up for MIDI sync. So now, start it. So I get the two syncing up together and I can speed up, stop it, start it again. And so we can sync up to six instruments this way with the six outputs. And you could even chain more than one of these things together to, um, to sync up even more instruments than that. OK, let's add some MIDI through from a controller keyboard. So I'll plug that into the MIDI input. And you can hear the notes being played through Reason, which I'm using as my sound source. You can see when I press a note, these two lights down here are flashing. This shows us we've got MIDI activity on the input. Um, that is being sent out to all of the outputs. The other thing it does is it, it does a MIDI through on the pitch bend and the mod wheel, so um, I'll show you that in a moment. So let's get it started. A bit faster. So let's arpeggiate it. So you So you can hear how the mod wheel and the pitch bend are also being sent through in addition to the note information.